Now, what should people know about colon cancer? Is it preventable in some cases? Colon, Heather? Yes, colon cancer can be prevented if it's caught early. Uh, generally, just like any other cancer, um, you need to do routine screenings and check, check on those things um, with your doctor. And the target age to start screening for colorectal cancer is age 50 for both men and women. Okay, so that is the key. Now, there are some exceptions, right? If someone has a history? Of... Yes, if they have a family history of colon cancer or personal history, or if they're having signs or symptoms, you need to consult a physician. Yeah, so 50 is a general guideline for most people. Right. Now, when someone reaches 50, how should they check into this uh, as far as uh, having a screening? Well, you definitely should consult with your doctor um, first and they will recommend what they think is right for you. If you are without health insurance, that's when we encourage you to call us um, and we can help you simply by a quick phone interview and then we will, in this case, mail something to you, a kit that you do in the privacy of your own home do it at your home and then you mail it back it goes directly to the lab and then you'll we'll get your results and call you and let you know um, the outcome now are there more people going in for colonoscopies is there really starting to be a trend where more people are doing this definitely I've noticed when I'm out in the field doing outreach it's it's not such a um, shy topic as you would think people mm -hmm. um, I, so many times oh I just had mine and it was no you know no big deal and you know by the time the top doctor woke me up after it I asked him when it was going to start it was already over and, um, and a lot of celebrities are coming out and talking about their experiences too so that's nice to have their buy-in and, and Ozzy Osbourne <laughs> <laughs> yeah. now I'm a celebrity but I have one coming up so you know my doctor was saying the a few weeks ago, I'm not going to let this go by, Good. you know, Good. you're at the age you should be doing this, so, right. and it's... you know, I have to admit, <laughs> I'm not going to make a big, big uh, <laughs> statement about this, but, but I will be going through this as well. That's great. That's, so, that's... so it is something that really everyone, when you approach 50, uh, you should be doing this. Yeah. yeah, because a lot of times there are no symptoms. Um, many people don't know that they have an issue or even a growth starting and and if they're doing the colonoscopy and they see the polyps even if they're precancerous they'll remove them at that time so you'll get peace of mind for a few more years mm -hmm. and now once someone has begun doing this how often what is the frequency generally um, if it is a negative colonoscopy they generally won't rescreen you for 10 years okay what if it if Pol polyps do turn up. Depending on um, the actual diagnosis of and the pathology of the polyps, the doctor would make that recommendation. Um, typically, I would believe it's about three to five years.